He drives across this country from sea to shining sea, remembering the sacrifice, how freedom don't come free. With the windshield full of what he loves, takes pride in what he didn't do. This soldier grabs another gear, and he rolls on. Stars, stripes, and white lines. What is up, guys? It's Legend Trucking here. I know it's been a while. I apologize. Um, I know I told you all to share the good, bad, ugly. Well, it's been ugly. It has definitely been ugly. I mean, it, there's been a lot going on here on the road. Uh, you know, the way things have been with this COVID crap, and it's been frustrating. And, you know, things have occurred over the time. Uh, so I want to apologize, you guys. I know it's doing good. I'm posting videos, and then I just kind of disappeared. I disappeared because I had to get my mind right. Yeah, it's a different angle. I got interrupted by a phone call. But, uh, yeah, I mean, it's it's been pretty ugly. I mean, I didn't want to come to you guys in a bad state of mind, talk out of anger and frustration, and then have to backpedal and try to take back something I said. So I've been wanting to put some numbers together. And, you know, it, it's been rough. I ain't going to see your states all been sunshine and rainbows and shit because it hasn't. But, uh, so I said I got some information together, you know. I've taught my company. I'm trying to change things around. Because if not, if I can't, King and Queen's going to have to go somewhere else um but it's gonna suck but I mean you're trying to make dreams happen sometimes you just gotta do what you gotta do especially when you got a family at home uh so you know I did a four month average of what the truck's bringing in and stuff you know cause I didn't wanna like shoot off the gun early cause I was thinking about when I was doing reviews and everything I was like well, I'm gonna get some information together you know, because things can change. I want to see how the freight market's going over here. It started off pretty decent. I mean, I can't complain. I was real close to what I need to bring home, average weekly. And then, you know, they supposedly we're not capped. To me, it looks like we're capped. Um, that's my opinion. But, uh, I mean, like, in February, was right by when I started. Started at the end of January, so February. You know, the truck brought in 68, average 68 for the month. Now, this also includes fuel surcharge, which is the customer's responsibility of fuel for their freight. And no taxes taken out. So, I don't want y'all to be like, oh, no, no. This is before taxes taken out and including the customer fuel surcharge. So the truck brought in 68 that month. So the average was 17 a week. March was 6,000. Average was 15. April was 6,700. Average was 16. And this month, the trucks brought in, I'm projecting next week because I pretty much got my stuff dialed in. 54 so it's went down a little bit it's going to be average 13 it's not bad it's not bad money it's not but I have very very low obligations I've made some crazy sacrifices um, I don't get much into personal things but I know if I had other things and other responsibilities this wouldn't cut it um I know what my truck needs to make. I'm trying to get my company to get it there so I can be more comfortable. Uh, so, I mean, that's where that's at. I wanted to come to you guys. You know, I know it's been a while and everything. And uh, it's been rough these past couple months, you know. But I've been trying, I'm always good about trying to keep my head up. And I've just had a lot going on and a lot on my mind. And I don't want to come to you guys like that. Like, I want you all to see me with a clear head when I talk to you, make these videos, so I don't blow smoke on my ass from being pissed off or irritated or 
give you guys wrong information. I want you guys to have all the right information if this is something you decide to do. Um, I know there's some guys out there can live off this. You know, hats off to them. But with my situation, this doesn't work. Um, I got obligations at home. You know, I got responsibilities. Uh, so that's where we're on that. I mean, if you guys want to know more, message me. I'll send you pictures what I got. I'm not going to post all my personal stuff online. Um, I got some vultures out there. and Some people that want to assume this or that. So I just keep it off here. But I mean, but before I projected everything, you know, I did this a couple. Right here, I just want to show you guys this little clip of I sixty five two forty where it randomly decided to you know, so start snowing and found out it got other places. Week average, it brought it down to fourteen of fourteen hundred a week before I took my taxes out. Yeah, like I said, I have some extremely low obligations, and I'm still barely making a buy. Um, so I'm hoping things can change. I've been begging and begging. I've talked. Um, we'll see where it goes from there. I'll keep you guys updated. I'm not going to fail. I'm not going to let anything take me down. I'm going to find a way to succeed. It just depends who's going to be the partner that helps me succeed with their name on the side of the door of mine. But uh, hope you all have a good week. Hope you all are making it through this COVID-19 COVID okay. Not too many issues. Um, I know a lot of people have lost their jobs and things. Um, so my thoughts are out there with you guys. Love y'all. Keep the shine side up.